In today's video, I'm gonna share with you a really great exercise and technique that is gonna help you to build connection with any person that you meet much faster than what you are probably used to. So I want you to imagine the scenario that you are going out to talk to someone, you're not quite in the mood yet, um, but the anxiety is there, you see someone that you wanna to talk to, you're also not quite in flow state yet, and you go over to say hello. You start the conversation, but it kind of feels like you're actually interrupting someone's day. And because of that nervous energy that you've got, it feels like that you aren't really giving off that attractive kind of vibe. Something that I want you to try and certainly consider is something called assuming rapport. So what do I mean by this? So assuming rapport with someone is like imagining that you have known someone for a really long time. And I want you to think about that for a moment. Imagine that there's a friend who's been traveling around the world and they've come back to your city and you saw them crossing the road in the distance and you're like, oh my God, I haven't seen that person in ages. How would you react? You'd probably, because I know I would at the very least, I'd go running over to stop them with maybe, maybe not a lot of energy, but I'd be quite enthusiastic, certainly charismatic, and I'd have the energy to be open and charming and be like, oh, how are you? I haven't seen you in ages. Tell me everything that you've been doing, you know? And what's interesting, especially as this kind of counts in the category of method acting, is that that energy that I would be bringing in that moment would be passed over to the person that I am talking to as well. The exercise that I want you to try is to imagine that any person that you wanna go and talk to, that you have known them for a really long time, that they are your best friend or that they are a really close friend at that. And when you go over, I want you to try and then incorporate that energy into how you would act if you did see someone that you haven't seen in a really long time. Now, for guys who are maybe not quite at that stage where they could go over and talk to someone, I want you to just role play it when you see people. So practice it on your own. You don't even have to go and talk to that stranger, but just imagine if you were to go and talk to them, how would you react? How would you behave? Now, again, I would probably react different to how you might react, and that is okay. But it's that idea in mind of imagining seeing that person that you haven't seen in a really long time, you were excited to see them, you missed them loads, and now you've gone over to catch up with them. And you'll find, especially with the women that you might wanna go and talk to, that suddenly that assumed rapport will get you that connection much quicker, as well as it will help you to relax into the conversation much faster as well. Now, this is something that might take a little bit of practice doing, but you might then find that when you go out to practice getting into flow state, you won't need to be spending hours upon hours doing it. It might only take you one or two approaches and suddenly you're relaxed. And the reason why this works is that I'm trying to get you to, uh, to calm down your sympathetic nervous system. It's that that causes that fight or flight reaction that when you see a moment for you to go and approach and do something, the body's fight or flight kicks in and it thinks you are going to be stepping into what is going to be a very stressful and dangerous situation, which it's not. You're going to talk to someone that you are attracted to. So the more we can try and encourage the sympathetic nervous system to calm down, method acting is certainly one way to actually do that you'll probably find through a bit of practice that you will end up talking to people as though you have known them for a very long time. I'd love to be able to hear how this works for you. So if you can, in the comments below, let me know how this goes if you practice the exercise. And if you do struggle with this exercise, let me know too, because then I can give you other exercises and techniques to try, or perhaps you can reach out and we can end up having a chat together about what steps you can be doing so you can start getting comfortable talking to strangers.
So on that note, you can definitely check out my website for that. But yeah, do let, let me know in the comments below how you get on with this exercise. Assume rapport with people that you meet. Imagine that they have been friends with you for a very long time and you are quite enthusiastic uh, in, in your own way though uh, to go and speak to them after a long hiatus. But other than that, if you can like the video, subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on all things that's gonna help you with your social anxiety, especially in the area of dating. And in fact, maybe below, let me know if there are any particular videos you would like for me to make too. But other than that, my name is Dan. I've been That Dating Anxiety Guy. And again, thank you very much for watching.